Welcome back to Why Won't the PlayStation Stop Screaming? It's... So Jenny, it wasn't even broadcasting the second I turned the game on. The fan came on. It just started getting louder and louder, then it settled at this obnoxious volume. Yeah. So we're having to talk over it. And hopefully it doesn't... Hopefully uh... you can hear us over the sound of the PlayStation going, Ah! It's like, oh no, life is strange. And also, when we first pressed, um, you know, uh, the, the press any button, the loading was like five minutes long. So yeah, so we're going to make sure we've got the Ultra 4K edition of Life is Strange fucking 2. Rudy's like, well, Jacob and Gemma, I made it, despite your directions. Well, this is unexpected. Well, um... I did put up a quick poll. Um, we aren't going to be. We aren't continuing it. We're starting from the beginning. Yeah, because... you put up a thing on Twitter saying, "Hey, do people want us to start again from the, the beginning, uh, or just start, or just jump straight into chapter two? And pretty much everyone voted for go from the beginning because we haven't actually played Life is Strange two since October of 2018. Yep. So yeah, I guess most people would have forgotten what the hell happened in the first episode. Guys, I'm leaving my grandmother's house in just a m one moment. Don't do anything funny without me. I'm calling voter fraud in that Twitter poll. <laughs> <laughs> Topical. Election jokes. Oh dear. Oh my. But how are we? And uh, MC Darius, hello. We're we're okay, aren't we? Um, how Is are it you? MC? I've been calling him McDarius. <laughs> I thought it Why didn't anybody tell me? <laughs> I look like a fucking fool. Well, um, I say MC because of the capitals. I would have thought that it would, um, with the two capital letters at the beginning. It might be McDarius, bro. I mean, can, can you Everyone just, le everyone for months has just let me sit here and make a cunt of myself say McDarius. Well, um, it's, it's not completely wrong. I, I never thought about how to pronounce the MC. Just do it feels natural. But what sounds better to you, McDarius or MC Darius? Also, I can't believe that old alleged rapist with questionable morals becomes president. Should we hit play? Yeah. New game, I guess. I guess. It's like we haven't got a safe file. We actually just played some of the first cutscene to check it was working. Yeah. I say working again. The the fan is trying not to let the PlayStation blow up from playing this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was what an idiotic question you asked. Like, how do I say which one sounds better? <laughs> like when, like, so I, I don't know. <laughs> I guess you'd put like a, a dot between them, wouldn't you? Look at this loading screen. What? Why is the tag in the description Look. Orange Man bad? You don't even live in America. Look at this fuck. When you've when you've got into this game a little bit more, you'll know why there's a joke about Orange Man bad on here. Yeah, no, it's 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 to do. It's with topical. The game. It's, it's to the kind. It's it's the kind of game it is. Like it, it, you know. Mm -hmm. McDarius sounds like a bootleg with Donald's. MC Darius sounds way better. Yeah. What about this person? Is it McShadier? Or... <laughs> I, I'm questioning everything now. <laughs> Biden so popular even the dead vote for him. It does sound like a Lucio Fulci movie, doesn't it? The dead are rising from their graves. It's like a heavy synth. Like, dun, 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 from beyond death, they have come back to vote Democrat. Coming soon to home video. The sniffer. Is it an elephant and 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 a giraffe? With the like the, the Democrat. No, I think the Democrat one's a donkey. Uh, 
We're not going to make a bunch of election jokes, by the way, it's just because that's where the topic went um, in the chat. Because people, were, somebody mentioned, why have you got Orange Man Bad as a tag? Um, I don't care. Yeah. Um, I don't live in that country. It's none of my business. You guys vote for whoever you want and, um, you know, vote for them twice, uh, you know, or pretend to vote for them, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> However you want to do it. Uncle Octopus, thank you very much. Why, why are you okay with hurting yourself? Because nothing in this world feels real anymore. Yeah. I think, to be honest, I genuinely think that uh, part of the reason why this year happened, like 2020, like, you know, everything went to shit was because of the amount of jokes people made in 2019 with the, what's going to happen in t next year? I don't have 2020 vision. I think that joke caused an yeah. apocalypse. Yeah. I think like, the best way of it being described, I think Ryan George is saying, like, um, I'm not really worried because right now two senile old men are arguing about who gets to be president during the apocalypse. That was a shaky... <laughs> yeah, it was a shaky old man argument. <laughs> who gets to be president during the apocalypse. Yeah, that's kind of how it feels. You have to admit, though, it's been very chaotic. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at these character models. You can see why um, the loading screens are five to ten minutes long, and my PlayStation is is making the the sound of you know, seven industrial windmills. De Death Stranding doesn't even do make that noise. No, Death Stranding runs fine. Yeah. Or you know walks fine. Um, but it <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, we can run Death Stranding no problems. This game is like ah. <sighs> Uh, it's almost like it's horribly optimised. Yeah. Who the fuck coded this Yandere Death? <laughs> just typing away, you know, just adding extra layers of code on top of bullshit code gun. I don't think... <laughs> I don't think disassociative identity disorder is real. He said that. Yandere Death. Oh, what's it? A... He's like, oh, it's just... Oh, I, I can't be doing with people with DID. It's just cringy. I'm like, Yandere, my guy. But could you stop? You can't be calling other people cringy and criticising them for role-playing. Those are two things you're in no position to criticise others for. Or no, one of those patches that says not safe for work. Well, somebody probably has drawn not safe for, for work art of this child. Oh, yeah. Because that's the world we live in. Yeah, deviant art. Emphasis on the deviant. I can't even hear the characters. Yeah, all you can hear is my PlayStation begging to be taken out into the garden and shot. Do you want me to turn that up a little bit? Volume. Yeah, you might as well. What? Okay, people keep asking about the noise. I'm just going to say it now, and I hopefully someone in the chat will say it when other people arrive, or if other people arrive. Um, it's the PlayStation. It can't fucking cope with this game. It runs every other game fine. This game is coded fucking horrendously, and it causes a tremendous... The, the loading screens take forever, and it causes a huge fucking strain on the PlayStation to, to run it at all. Oh, does that mean your PS4's name is Old Yeller? Oh yeah, this was set at Halloween. Mm -hmm. I forgot about that. This we're playing at the right time of year. Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Yeah, okay. It's, it's Friday. Friday. We're back. Right. I'm just. Machine sounds? Yeah. Can you hear us a little better? This is the most awkward cigarette smoke in the history of cigarette smoking. Thanks, Thanks for the smoke. smoke. Oh, and I'll make I'll sure you're not sure smoking you YouTube tonight. Deal? Deal. <laughs> Can't, Can't wait, wait to see you face this out. I just go here song. and I already hate these characters.
I'm glad that they haven't held back on like the gripping like action of the previous Life is Strange games. Oh yeah, like I want to fall asleep. You know, in, in the first one there's a murder to investigate. In this one they're planning a party. And in the prequel nothing happens at all. What was the pr plot to the, to the prequel? It was Chloe and Rachel, and their gay relationship, discovering each other. Because there wasn't a plot, was there? No. Like nothing fucking happened. Like I, I'm not trying to be edgy. Like I, rem I remember. Well, I remember nothing. Like I do not remember there being a plot. Remember we played like the entire thing, waiting for the story to start, and it never did. Yeah, I think it was something to do with like a parent coming back. Life is Chungus 3. <laughs> it's not very wholesome Keanu Reeves of you. Jacob, why do you subject yourself to this horror? I do not know, and the PlayStation doesn't know either. Hey, hey, Jacob's it knows. subjecting to it. I'm the one who's got to play the damn thing. 1452, Lave Avenue. Oh, well, that's a, well, that's a good one. That's oh, biting satire. Oh, mwah. Premium, 10 out of 10. Best dialogue, mwah. Uncle Octopus, thank you very much. This is not a game, this is a glorified DVD menu with even less of a plot. How the hell does this put such a strain on your PS4? As I said, it's fucking optimized horrendously. That's why. The, 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 I'm just picturing just like a wall of code that like looks... You know when you, you don't attend to like all your cables at the back of the TV for months and even though you don't touch them, they just get more and more. That's what I'm picturing, that just with like words and numbers. <laughs> Bioman12, thank you very much for the, uh, the 299. This hurts my soul and my eyes. <laughs> yeah. You know that a game's not doing its job right when it makes you envy the blind. No, you can't, because your dad will be dead by then, and you'll be on the run. Yep. Oh, yeah, spoiler. Yeah, because I remember this one actually has a plot. Yeah. Which is why it's better than Life is Strange Before the Storm. Yeah. We say better. Story-wise. Not so much anything else. So I'm sure, like, a cop turns up and he's like, stop resisting. Yeah, oh, yeah. Um, there is the, uh, violence. I'd rather play a Sonic game. Oh, oh, let's let's not say something we can't take back. I'll be honest, I'm pretty gripped. Yeah, me too. I really, I really want to know who's going to get the cookie. Yeah. I'm sure it'll have a massive fucking impact on uh, on the, the rest of the story, so really think about it. Thank you, Pterodax. I'm hearing a slight echo, or do they have the voice of Legion? It would explain why they all look so soulless. The echo is probably because we turned up the TV a bit so you could hear it, to be honest. We can yeah. turn it down again if you like. Um, all right. 
Right, I'm going to give it to the dad. Because he's going to die anyway. I'm really sorry, ladies and gentlemen, man, but there will be no boogaloo. Yes. The, um, the new guy at my work is completely obsessed with that moment in the 90s is Judge Dredd movie that you just did. Yeah. Like he keeps doing it. Because since he found out that I have seen that movie, <laughs> he'll find any excuse to just go, <laughs> at me. I will say he does the impression very well, he does the face and everything. And, um, actually, no, there's no negative. I was going to say it gets really tiresome, it doesn't. It's oh, okay. tremendously funny. Oh my god, I'm, I can move. <laughs> Wouldn't it be an amazing twist if the ending of this game hinged on who got to eat the chocolate bar? It would. It would be weird and stupid, but, you know, it's life is strange, right? I can actually move. Do, do, do. Look at the little fire Blown away by the pulse pounding action. <laughs> Stop. Play box. Yeah, you probably watched the new Top Gear. You know, watch the Grand Tour instead. What was that really bad? What Fifth Gear? Fifth Gear was bad. That was bad. Jeez, how old is this? Well, and you know how old you are, <laughs> like how old it is then. <laughs> oh, she, oh, he's retarded. <laughs> this game about him. Maybe he shouldn't be going to a party. Maybe he should be fucking studying for maths. <laughs> if he can't take his current age. <laughs> and then extrapolate from his current age. How long he has had that pumpkin, bearing in mind he knows he has had it since the age of 10. Like, this game is so boring that there isn't even any conflict with the stupid pointless shit. Like, yeah, my dad really wants to watch this film trilogy. I like it as well. <laughs> like, there is nothing. I'll tell you what, that racist, trigger happy policeman can't get here fast enough. <laughs> Mr. Diaz, your property line overhangs on mine, and your children are alive and won't stay on their side. I've told you many times. Fence, no I don't think that Scott Vaughan Foster talks like that, Gemma. I don't think you're really putting in enough conviction, all right, for the voice acting. This is a triple-A game that's nearly killing our PlayStation. You need to... I need to feel it. Mr. Diaz, your property <laughs> line overhangs on That's mine, better. And your children are loud. I won't stay on their side. I have told you many times to build a legal proper fence no higher than six feet according to Seattle Land Use Code between our two properties and you have not done it yet. I know my rights as a U.S. citizen. Maybe you don't and I expect you to also follow the rules. Because he's Mexican! If you do not That's why he doesn't know the rules and his rights as a U.S. citizen. Yep. That's because it. everyone hates Mexicans. Yes. If you do this not. This is fucking peak 2017, this game. If you do not build a proper fence, then I might take you to small claims court for damages. Oh, You're a neighbor. feeling it now, Mr. Krabs. Scott Von Foster. That's, That's right. right. Give, give me a name. This is really, really boring. Just a dead, dead, kill me. I can't 
<laughs> build a proper fence, more like build the wall. <laughs> <laughs> Organization Organization is perfect. Perfect. Jimma hums a happy tune as she loads the gun. <laughs> Look at those textures, no wonder the PlayStation can't cope. Our assets of the decade, folks. I am not having the best time. I totally don't want to kill myself right now. Cross the hat out of this. Deep down, dreams to go. Yo, yo. That secret recipe is fucking old. Thanks for sharing. I don't care. Also, he's talking to himself, like, you know, like, in, in the reality of the game, he's not an avatar being played by somebody else, you know what I mean? Within the internal logic of the game, he's a person making his own choices. So why would he be walking around going, my dad's secret, to himself, my dad's secret recipe, oh, I forgot he's mentally handicapped. <laughs> well, sure is great being a 15-year-old boy. I've had this since I was 10. God, how long have I had it? Get in the oven! Fucking idiot. Okay. Better take that instead. This game has everything, guys. It's got bad language. It's got pasta recipes. One more two on. It's got decisions about who gets to eat chocolate. I mean Zelda. <laughs> More like Zell terrible. Nailed it. More like Super Lameo Brothers. Oh, let me read back these text messages. No, because I just saw dank memes and now I want to burn myself living. I'm drowning myself t into dank memes. I'm drowning myself into dank memes poop emoji. <laughs> I wonder who they're talking about. He's not actually gonna win. <laughs> Fuck off! October 19th, 2016. Oh, Jeb Orange Man, bad. Yeah. <laughs> I tell you what, it's a really good. It's a really good thing this time, though, in 2020, that the party of love and tolerance won instead, because this now, all the love and tolerance people don't have to burn cities to the ground. Yeah, we had a bunch of people unsubscribe because I made a joke like that. Like about a week after the election, I, I, Matt made a joke about um, burning city centre. And I went, yeah, the, um, love trumping hate uh, involves a lot more looting and, uh, and property destruction than I expected. <laughs> that was it. That's, that was the only joke I made. And like, tons of people unsubscribed. Oh, <laughs> just look in the chat, people are just miserable. Just like, please kill me. <laughs> like, they're not even making jokes now. They're just like, I want this to end. Like, let's go, please. <laughs> well, it's not it's my, my turn, turn to do the laundry. laundry. Okay. Daniel Bell will not use my tooth brush again. again. Thank you, Sam English bloke. The only important decision to make when playing a Life is Strange game is whether or not to jump out of a window or commit toaster bath. You don't? Not with that fuck. <laughs> Look at that fucking haircut. Like, how is he... I get he's meant to be an awkward teenager, right? But how is he going to pull with that hair? He's not... Just like... Mess it up a bit, you know? Push it over to one side. It's 2016. 
into jurisdiction. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn. turn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why this made me laugh so much. I hope this game was an interaction where you can go up to a toilet and he's like, man, this is a toilet. <laughs> if I had a daughter and she came home with this kid, I'd put her up for adoption. Okay, we're giving advice about females. <laughs> He's a sick. Yeah, uh, perhaps we could play as her instead. Yeah. <laughs> He's printing votes in there. <laughs> So one of my friends figured out the maths behind um, the the ballot thing. Um, you know the the number of ballots. I'll, I'll see if I can find what he sent me. But the the number of ballots that arrived the other day, the other you know, late the late postal ballots, and there was X number for Biden and none for Trump. And he figured out the um, the statistical likelihood of that actually happening. Yeah. Let's find it. Um, ah yes. So. It was 140,000, that was it. 140,000 votes all for one person in a single drop. That's the same statistic likelihood of winning the lottery. Ten times. It is so close to zero. It is, in fact, I think he, yeah, he actually sent me the number as well. Let's find that. It's basically a statistical impossibility. 0 0.0000000. It goes on for like lines of this. 7%. <laughs> But uh, hey, at least it wasn't Russia this time, right? Yep. No collusion. Very funny, I don't know. Can we just, like, you know... <sighs> just any other thing to be doing in this game, like... Yeah, yeah, the, all the Halloween yeah, shit. Maybe yeah, just yeah, going yeah. trick or treating. That was apt. Was that a dumpster fire? Let me see. Hold on. The background of that picture you just you just looked at. I'm going I back. wasn't looking. I was reading the chat. Yep, that is a dumpster fire. <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> That's so perfect. <laughs> there it is. That's the po that's your poster. Life is strange too. A fucking time capsule of the year 2016. Yep. What a shit show that year was. It was. A 2020 on the other hand. Masterpiece. Oh, best shit. No, Alright, is 2020 worse or better than 2017? Well, for me personally, it's better. Because no one tremendously important to me has died. Um, but generally, it's much worse. Even this year, I've lost relatives, just oh, not no. like ones that, you know, were as important as those I lost in 2017. Yeah. Work uniform, that doesn't look like the uniform for sitting outside a Home Depot. <laughs> Oh my god, he's a real gamer. Cool. 
real game. <laughs> it's just a woman being beaten. <laughs> it, was a game, it was a pro gamer move. I should try to assist him to put him in the mirror here. But it didn't look at you now. Told him not to take a picture of me and get the race. I love like a sweaty baby. Yes. Someone asked in the chat who is the target audience of this game. I want to sound like a boomer, but liberals. Yeah. It's really kind of smug, self-entitled, fat liberals with really long beards. Yes. That's the, that's the entire... Or... or yeah, uh, dyed hair. Those are the only people that are going to play this. And of course, people like us that are playing it to make fun of it. I oh, do that's cultural appropriation. Haha, <laughs> 2016 humor! Yep. Oh, I'm such a fucking funny guy. Neck beards and danger hairs. Yeah, those are people watching that will be playing this shit. The, tar the target audience for this game is Discord mods. I spent the day perma banning people, Queen, but you still haven't sent me those feet pictures. Thank you, Bioman. Man. Calling it now. Move over, Blood Whistle. This is horrible. Well, I'm drawing. Okay, are you actually drawing, though? No. Yeah, I'm moving to draw. So, you're not actually drawing anything. You're... Like, the one thing they could have done is have you use the stick or, like, the motion controls or whatever to draw something, and you actually draw it. Whoever it was in the chat who described this as a DVD menu was absolutely right. What's the point of this game? Um, we're going to a party, I think. But we're uh, we're literally killing time now. Not literally. That would be impossible. We're killing time in a game, waiting for something to happen. The game is j is punishing us and going right. Well, you can't just go right to the party. So you've got to hang out in your house for a bit. I have a house. I can hang out here. Yes. Why is this a video game? I drew a picture, and he has a light that's like that looks a bit like the the prize you get inside of Kinder Surprise. This, yes, it does. <laughs> this is so perfect. Uh, the target audience of this game is people who make web comics where they win fake arguments with characters they made up. <laughs> that's brilliant. VR house simulator for the pro gamer who's completely given up on ever having a life. It's amazing how impatient these games make me feel. Yeah. I'm broke, so, so I better, better find, find some cash for some money. Could there just be a monster down there? You know, just, just give me something. Like I don't mind the idea of a game that's just a drama. 
Because yeah, there's plenty of good movies that are dramas. Except there's no drama. No. Like, I know something happens eventually, but we're just kind of waiting. And just fucking biding our time. I'm just trying to remember what all the other things that I need. Because I'm just trying to retrace my steps so that it'd be easy. That should just sound like my back. Is there any of that pasta left, or did you eat it all? We eat all. Right. I'm sure Dad had him in his one more night and his night. Can't be bad as we ask him to tag us as well. Bide in your time, am I right? Well, yeah, we just, uh. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm actually just quiet. This is why I'm not talking much. I'm just quietly practicing necromancy so I can get more votes. <laughs> what was that one webcomic where the person made like a terrible straw man character and the internet like really liked him and like it was like a big hulking guy. I think he worked at like a convenience store or a or a grocery store or something like that, or maybe a warehouse. And the audience just like all much preferred him and started making fan art of him. And the the artist got really fucking pissed off on Twitter because everyone's pissed off on Twitter all the time or trying to knock some kids. Yeah. Can we not be playing Chupacabras from outer space, please? That, that sounds much, much better. Why would you put a poster up? Of something called Chupacabras from Outer Space in your game that is about walking around the garage. <laughs> You're just fucking with us at this point. I know. You're just reminding me that things that are exciting could be happening. I'm giving. I'm giving. Like, I'm. I'm finding tools for my dad. New guy, that was his name. Should we just be evil? Is there, is there an evil option in this game? Kinda. Can we just go brain the dad? Most of part where he orders pizza and watches The Dark Knight. At least there was a giant killer hedgehog from another dimension in that. I can't believe I'm saying this, but Sonic EXE, the remake, was far more exciting than this. Yes, it was. Yeah. At least I had jump scares ripped wholesale from It. It totally did. <laughs> You're playing Life is Strange 2, not Shadow the Hedgehog. I've, I mean, Shadow the Hedgehog, I don't know if I'd rather be playing that because trying to get the second ending in the game, I got so frustrated with the horrible level design. Whereas with this, there really is no level design. You just walk from one dialogue tree to another. You can't really fail at it. No. Because from the beginning of the first game, at least, you had the ability to rewind time. Yeah. Which was a, 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 a gimmick. Yeah, which they took from Prince of Persia, The Sands of Time. A game where things happen. Yes. It was an interesting setting and an interesting characters. I mean, the characters were kind of one-dimensional, but more interesting than the characters in Life is Strange. How there's six nine people here. Like Aha, ah, funny sex number. It is a funny sex number. 
So, what does this, what does this hoodie mean? Because it's got like a squad, it's a squad, but it's got a wolf, oh, uh, some sort of wolf squad. Wouldn't it be pack? I mean, when we're in the party, party. Uh, 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 just, just be honest. honest. No bullshit. I mean, you can use my own. Really? Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah, but the party in the house is nobody's going to be here. I swear. A little bit of a good thing. But yeah, yeah. That's right, give your, give your son money to buy alcohol and drugs. Your son who definitely looks underage. Give him $40 to get loaded. Yep. No wonder your wife left you. Or died, I don't know, I haven't really been paying attention, but... I don't know yet either. If I were trapped in a locked room with the writer of this game and Hitler and had only one bullet, I'd kill Hitler, but I'd really have to think about it first. <laughs> Fuck me. Apologies for if I'm being yeah. silent. I'm just trying to get... Just get paying to attention to the riveting story. Oh, yeah, totally. Oh, poster. I feel like... Yeah, the, 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 the kind of... Um, literature, shall we say, that we've read over the years on our show. We don't exactly have high standards for writing. Billy and the Rich Boys. How about Chris and the Hedgehog boy? <laughs> Someone should make a mod of this game that is in, it is fucking identical. But they just replaced that one poster yes. with Chris and the Hedgehog boys. Oh, yes. I can't hear you. I'm not just doing it. Fine, ready to go. Time to stay you can tell all the people who made this game have ever interacted with a Mexican person. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not made for Mexicans, it's made for white, white liberals that want to feel smug. It is, it's totally... It's, totally like, it's made for university professors. Yeah. Who really enjoy speaking for minorities. That's exactly who this game's made for. Basically, yeah. cunts. Yeah. I think that. <laughs> But I don't know how, how long away that is. Because <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure what, how old I am. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like... <laughs> the pumpkin, I'm not going to let the pumpkin thing go. It's just about acceptable for a teenager to be using Facebook in 2016. Yeah, it's almost... Just about.
It's also almost okay to use Skype around this time. Not not teenagers though. Teenagers are way too ahead of the curve to still be using Skype in 2016. Like fit like the Facebook thing is pushing it a bit, but Skype absolutely not. Like Skype is for uh, boomers. I don't know. So people are, people have already got to deal with the you know anyway, the, no ju the jet engine. No worries. So I'm saying I need to pay attention to what they're saying so that I know what I'm doing. I'll read the subtitles, aren't you? Yeah, that's what I was supposed to do. Sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. No, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's mine. Don't jinx me. Tyre could be seven before it takes off. Yeah, I've made this joke already, but oh, it's not even really a joke. Just, just an uh, observation. An observation, really, that it runs everything else fine. Yep, even Death Stranding. Yeah, God of War, Death Stranding. It, do it doesn't really matter. It, it, it only does this on Life is Strange too. And again, the, the loading times are fucking Sonic 06 level. Interesting. Like, why? There isn't even enough story here for a film. Oh god, no. He's got a fidget spinner! I'm just gonna play with this and watch my NNA Productions videos. <laughs> and you cut this much out of that button. You know, it is 2016 after all. That's true. Yeah, even though <clears> in 2020 he's making the same videos. That's tragic, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, he's nothing if not consistent. Yeah. I have to work at the store this weekend. I think they're just yeah. sitting in silence. Just on Skype. Hold on, okay? Oh, it's happening. The plot. So, did you see that, that subtitle? Something's going on. I mean, we'll fucking see, but. Wow, Gemma, you really are picking the evil path, aren't you? I was just kind of kidding. Take the little baby back to his crib. Come on, Daniel. We've done it. Yeah, go back to Daddy. I guarantee whichever option you you choose, you punch the, the kid in the face as well. It's one of them was confront him. 
That's obvious. This is obviously what happens when you pick that option as well. Yeah. Alright, now crap at his butt. Okay. Okay, step away. Now. Calm down, officer. Shut up. And step back. On the ground. Now. Hey, wait. This guy was starting to Dude, he has a gun on you. Just fucking do as he says. Yeah, just. Don't be a hero! Yeah, I like, I'm not saying this is an appropriate way for a police officer to behave, but that's a conversation for another fucking time! Like, just don't get shot! Now, charge at the, at the twitchy armed police officer. That's the only smart thing to do in this scenario. What you say? Ooh, that you only meant well. well 2016. It's, it's, it was still okay to make that joke then. Did that our cops are evil? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. But it's framed in such a stupid way that like the message you take from the from the scene isn't oh what a shitty cop yeah it's that was fucking dumb and avoidable yes yeah, like oh this is totally avoidable yeah it's like maybe just don't get shot and then later on deal with the fact the cop was a fucking moron and pulled his gun for no reason they would be like, wow, that cop is really twitchy and trigger happy. I'm going to fucking charge at him like a retard. Yeah. Ridiculous. Come on. Oh, yeah. Bum, 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 bum. The plot is here. But do. It's taken us an hour. Seriously? It's been an hour? I don't know how long it's been, but you know, it certainly feels like an hour. The Mexican can kill the bully, I have no fucking idea. Uh, he, basically, there was a, a rock went into the yeah. into his spine, so he's more yeah. slightly paralysed if he's if not dead. Your actions have consequences. Bullshit! Like when you when they said, "Oh, who gets the cookie?" You chose the dad. It went to the kid anyway. You sided with the bully, you still ended up killing the bully. It doesn't make a fucking difference. Yeah. It's one set path that you will end up on regardless. Oh. But everything in the first game really just whittled down to will I save this horrible cunt character or, or will I save the whole town? And naturally you pick whole town and then the game's over. And yeah. a bunch of like whales fall out the sky or something. I don't really remember. I think I've had trust issues ever since Mass Effect 3 when it comes to these kind of games. Like, your actions have consequences! Mass Effect 3 upset me in a way that it really shouldn't, but did. So I wasn't even a big Mass Effect fan. But, like, playing Mass Effect 3 was just horrible. I loved Mass Effect. Mass Effect 2 is one of my favourite, sort of, like, like, one of my favourite games from no, Bioware, man. and... I can't stop you. Mass Effect 3 was just... No Sad. pouting, okay? Come on. I'll, I'll keep you really hurt. This shit just sucks. We've been watching for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that. Fate choices with a linear story. What is this Fallout 4? I was there too. Just knock it off. Idiot. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being, being at home or in the room. Life is strange too, but every time a white person shows up, Sephiroth's battle theme plays. So, <laughs> come on, let's 
Perfect. Well, it is square. I mean, I imagine they have the, the rights to use it. Well, really, what we should be doing is we should get our TV and watch Final Fantasy Spirits Within, which is, in fact, the best no. sci-fi movie of all time. No. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Isn't it? I would say this game is actually slightly worse than Final Fantasy The Spirits Within. Yeah. So at least that's a movie that isn't, while it's apparently takes place in, in sort of a game universe, it isn't pretending to be a video game. No, this is a really long movie pretending to be a video game. I just wish I was back in my room. No. No. Hey. Okay, so for our mod of Life is Strange 2, so far we've got... Replacing that one poster with Christian and the Hedgehog Boys, we've got the Sephiroth battle theme playing every time a white person shows up. Man off the Hands of Fate is more through this. Yeah, this game doesn't have a guy with goat legs who's wearing them incorrectly. And who's high on acid the entire time. <laughs> I, I, you know, I enjoy a lot of shit movies. Like anyone who's in the Discord and has been on movie, I, I went, I went back to the Discord by the way for anyone who gives a shit. I went back recently so, so I could facilitate movie nights again because now that like lockdown two is happening. Although it's not a lockdown for me because I'm still allowed to work, but it is for a lot of people. Now that lockdown two is happening, I'm doing movie nights again. Anyway, if you know the kind of shit I enjoy, you know I like me some crap. Yep. I fucking hate Man of the Hands of Fate. Man of the Hands of Fate is. Like I love the riff tracks of it, but it's still but it's still painful to watch yeah, it's, with the riff tracks and it's, the background. It's just such a boring movie. It's so boring. No way, not fair. Whatever. Okay, I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you. Just me, or does the younger kid just look like a char like a, a white character model, but with a tan? Oh look, he's discarded his mask. That means that something. He's pu putting away his childhood, or something. Fuck off. <laughs> 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 Fucking bullshit. Shut up. They, they usually have to put some game in between them, though. Yeah, like that's the thing is like with them, um, say Kojima's games like Metal Gear Solid and like Death Stranding. I love those games like wholeheartedly. I love the long cutscenes because you're invested and yeah. really gripped by the story. I don't give two shits about what's happening on this t on TV. But yeah, I'm thinking of watching Strike Commando for the next movie night. Totally. You, yeah, we need to. If you haven't joined the movie nights, you should. Um, night before last, we watched... Uh, your? We watched Your Hunter from the Future. Now, I'll be honest with you, I've never seen Parasite. I've seen Your about three times, maybe four. Yeah, that's been about the same amount of times I've seen it. Um, God knows how many times I've seen Strike Commando. I think we watched it like three, like three nights in a row. Yeah. Strike Commando is just, just a fucking masterpiece. It is. <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're watching uh, we're watching quite a bit of Red Brown in the uh, movie nights at the moment. He's kind of become a bit of a a bit of a hero in the Discord. He's like our. Uh, we think he should be Rocket Fist Rick in yes. the movie of Stones to Abigail. He would, he would be utterly yes. perfect. He's the only actor capable. Yeah. I'm tired and hungry too. This rocket fist Rick built like a brick shit house. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp. I bet we're not the first people to just did that. Maybe that's why they um they mentioned how much they like the Lord of the Rings at the beginning of the game was to establish how much fucking walking you're gonna have to be witnessing. Don't compare this to Lord of the Rings. 
I mean, to be fair, I, you know, I quite like Death Stranding, which is mostly walking. Yeah, but there's story. That's yeah, there's really a, there's, an in, there's an interesting plot, and it, there's actually oh. tense, and oh. uh, you know, there's like stealth and stuff. There's there's gameplay. There's none here. A car out here. Hope the driver isn't around and watching us. Just steal the car. What's wrong with you? You don't know how to steal a car, you fucking Mexican. That's right, folks. Racism. Now laugh. Check it out. There's a chunky chocolate crisp bar on the dashboard. On the comedy pioneer. Yes. You know I love chocolate crisp bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. Shut up. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please get one when we stop next? Please. Just running, We're running in a this fucking way. straight line. Nobody's gonna miss one single token this far. Really? I will. This is for a good cause. It's like they played Crash Bandicoot, oh, you know, because you're kind of on rails in that game. And they went, well, we need to take all the sort of jumping and spinning and monsters and music Choco and everything else. Yeah. Now we what would be good if we were just going in a straight, unavoidable it's path it's like this? It's a fucking but it was two children talking to each other. Just that that would just make it much better. I don't know if it's mad. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Hey, that'd be a landslide. That would have been interesting to see. Should yeah, not hear about it. I don't know. I guess they missed that call. Bears can get into your car. Yes. Can we play that game? Yes. Can we can we play a game as a can we play Banjo Kazooie instead? Yeah, let's play Banjo Kazooie. Now we can see where we are. Oh hell, just a game where you just a mini game where you're defending your car from bears. <laughs> Something you play on your phone. You know, it's no. been done. Uh, it's not it's groundbreaking, great. but that would be gameplay. There's a game element there, there's a challenge. The only challenge with, with this is not pulling out your fucking hair. I'm glad my hair is short enough. Pterodax, thank you for the donation. Less of a thank you for the question, though. How would Cannibal hand Holocaust hand. work as a game? I don't know that it would. Um, basically, you would get. I guess you get ranked on the kind of atrocities you can commit against the tribe. So you'd rack up... Kind of like Mad World, you'd rack up points the nastier it got. So, oh, you burned down the village, yeah, but you also impale one of them. Yeah. It's like, oh, you know, interactive rape, and then you ram a fucking spike through one of them. That's an unpleasant film. I'm never watching that one again, for sure. Same with Irreversible. Okay, would you rather play this or Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts? This. Yeah. Fucking Nuts and Bolts. Fuck it. So like, if hard. this. Was 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 you know the same game as this, except it starred like Conker from Conker's Best Fur Day. <laughs> like I hate it a lot more because it would be garbage and it would be tarnishing the legacy of something I care about. You know, it's uh, why there's a lot of garbage on television that I don't care about. But Star Trek Picard pisses me off in a very unique way because it's tarnishing something I care about. This. This this had no hope of ever being good. No, There's no legacy for it to stand on. Not exactly. It's called a trail blaze. And people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? Yeah, sure. Just slightly more energy. Awesome. Let's follow it. Thank you, Plague Doctor. Thank you very much. He says, a raccoon can fit inside a four inch hole. A human rectum can be stretched up to eight inches. Do with this information what you will. Thank you. Thank you for sharing that. You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? As long as you don't mind the poison ivy on your balls. What do you think when Richard Gere put the gerbil up Emma Stone's ass? I don't want to get stuck in it. Oh yeah, because she looks a bit like a gerbil. <laughs> Do 
Are these characters better or worse than Chloe? No one's worse than Chloe. These are worse than the ones at school. What was one of her famous lines? It's like, it's like because if I, you know, it has if to I, be my fault. Fuck that. It's like I have to, got to blame someone. Otherwise, it's all my fault. Fuck that. I'm like, yeah, screw responsibility. Like she and she likens her stepdad to Hitler on more than one occasion, and he's one of the most reasonable people in the whole story. It's like the movie Twilight, and literally the only person you're rooting for is Charlie. Yeah, except people don't call Charlie Hitler. No, no, they don't. Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? Mr. Minecraft. I watched you build giant cities out of log. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh. I can use my ass to chop up. This game just reminded me how much I would hate to be lost in the woods with Logan. That always knew exactly what that. Oh Jesus Christ. I can't imagine that. Well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Children are just awful. Mm -hmm. What are we doing out here? Well, Sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Where are we going? Hmm. The river must be a bit further. We don't have much. This is better. Should than I nothing. eat the berries? The river must be a bit further. Yeah, what's gonna happen? We're gonna get a we're gonna get a fucking game over, are you? Who gives a shit? Nothing you do in this game fucking matters. You look like blueberries. Just eat the fucking poison. Oh, if we had a pizza, then a chili dog, then a cheeseburger, then nachos, then a milkshake. <laughs> then you'd be living do healthy food. That's cool. <laughs> then you'd be living in the bathroom. Dude, I found some berries. Come get some. <laughs> just eat the oh fucking God. poison. Cope show in 2020. I don't think Danny understands what's going on. <laughs> These ones really taste bad. Must be toxic. Looks like a message for Minecraft players. I want to look at the sign with the bear on it. How the berries, Ralph? Good. Well, I bet nobody comes out here to picnic anymore. Well, that's good for us. Okay. Well, I'm going to go and look for berries in the kitchen. Okay, leave me here alone. I'll look at the, the chat. She's like, yes, that leaves me here to talk to the audience. <laughs> oh, God, this is always death. <laughs> well, thank you, Teradax, with the five... For the five bucks, I'm not that familiar with the gameplay in the series. Could you run off a cliff, or are there invisible walls? Well, it's very linear, and I've got to follow the story. More like squirrels, rabbits, critters. No, I don't think so. Just don't bug them, and they won't bug us. They're way more scared of us than we are. Of them. Unless they're angry. Like, why does their skin okay. look raw? I don't know. I really don't. Let's go. Now we know what not to do. Doki Doki Literature Club was more interesting than this. I actually have to agree. Even though there was less gameplay in that, the story was at least kind of so bad it was fun to, uh, to make fun of. Let's just hope that doesn't happen. Don't you think it is a at least creative? Yeah, that's the. Like yeah. It wasn't a video game. I maintain that it's not a game. Yeah. Like it's it's you know it's a it's a cartoon without any animation. Um, but there was a meta narrative and there was a tone that was interesting. It tried. It was shit, but it tried. I don't feel like this is trying. No. This is just sort of cashing in. It's like, yeah, well, you know. I wonder what this has to do with the first game. I know it's set in Arca like Arcadia Bay is sort of like... Mm. I know that's part of Arcadia Bay, but that's... 
Well, this is still phase one of the um, Life is Strange universe, isn't it? So yeah. you have to get to the end of it when it's like the Avengers. And like okay. him, Chloe, and Captain Autismo are all and then fighting, I don't know. The teacher that looks like me from the first one. one. If there's there any other villains. Two. The tornado. They all come together in Life is Strange Endgame to elect to a point in. I'm going to make a sandwich and then I will return. I hope that people are alright with me making a sandwich. Are you okay with Code making a sandwich? I, I mean, I'm going to anyway, but I just think <laughs> this will go a lot smoother if people are okay with it. Yeah. So Gemma, I have a question. Why does the town blow up? Um, because someone had a vision. I don't know. Raccoons are way smarter than us. We'll find. Hey, don't think about stuff like that. I do not want to get stuck out here. We've got to find a campsite. Well, what? Why isn't the woman making the sandwich, Co? I don't know. Silence, I'm... Reddit user. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, I think this path leads to the river. I'm sitting down. Cope is very particular about his sandwiches. The Minecraft references are so boomer. I know this is what like French people think teenagers sound like. that there aren't any French teenagers. <laughs> I'm just trying to, trying to make some food. They just hear from here, it's like, hey, this is what French people think teenagers are like. <laughs> What's the shortage over there? Yeah. It's... All the elderly crowd around and tell stories. <laughs> you remember the teenagers. It's like There's something from the old world. Children of men over there. Daniel is stuck behind. I should get in your hand. From the woman who brought you the Barb is Dead theory, Gemma Miller, there's no French teenager. Gemma, in your opinion, would the 
plot be better for the main character with an ECL and the reason he's running away is because he needs to get the state lines where the age of consent is legal. Well, it would work considering it's the same it's the same state that he lives in. Fucking hell, where are you? I see. Come on. I got you. Mm. Oui, oui, I am the teenager. I listen to the indie music and have less of a power work. Don't say mean thing to me or I will crawl. <laughs> this game looks so basic for a AAA release. I know. It's ridiculous. Come on. This game is such a fantastic soundtrack. I especially like the chirps chirping like away every minute. <laughs> Demon, thanks very much for the right, kroner, man. 20 kroner. What if Jeff was good? Oh wait, that's impossible. This game's a bunch of poopy bits. Come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good tracks. Oh, shut up about the Minecraft references. Minecraft, am I right? Trees, branches. Who can stop it? No. It's a game that references old memes, and there's a character called Dam Daniel. I'm fearing a damn Daniel reference somewhere. Oh God. Oh God! I just remember they used fucking rage comics okay. in the first game. Yes, they did. It's the fucking why you know guy. Sorry, I've just made it very even harder for you to sit back. Well, that's getting taken out of context by everyone in the chat. Thanks for that one, Gemma. What's that? I'm not fucking repeating it. I just meant like. <laughs> I was just like, because I'm my feet up. <laughs> um, Bioman12, uh, thanks for the $1.99. Oh, because of your feet, yeah. yeah. That'll make it not weird. Thanks for, <laughs> thanks for clearing that up for everyone. I know what I meant. Still hoping for Jason Voorhees to appear. <laughs> like, did I miss a Minecraft reference? I'm glad I did. Coming. <laughs> Old memes in my walking simulator. This is so hella poggers. <laughs> oh, God, I want to die. Yeah. Sorry, I missed it. Thanks for quoting me. Uh, I said. I said, didn't I? Yeah. You're brave to challenge me. I had it. I had the innocent thing in my in my head. Imagine if they look fully committed to trying to trying to make this like meme teenage dialogue. Yeah. Like the kid annoys you and you're just like, son, I'm going to say the end one. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> nice and dry. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for quoting my I have an innocent thing in my head. Gemma Mill 2020. No 
Okay, lazy. Go we'll find some wood. What kind of did you make? Potato waffle with egg. <laughs> That's that sounds really nice, actually. It's, it's children's food. It's amazing. <laughs> I wonder if the troll face is going to show up in some form. You've been walking for so long. I think that was in the first one as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Alright, how much you got? It's all there. Yeah, okay. That should be enough for the night. Chat is funnier than <laughs> anything in the game. Alright. What would you rather do? Play this or watch Irate fire. Gamer? Yeah. Irate Gamer! Because out. Irate Gamer we can laugh. The amazing thing I've noticed about Chris Balls is people laugh at him. They don't laugh with him. It's mm -hmm. extraordinary. Look at that face. It's a run the current of tragedy to it. I actually love Irate Gamer, but mostly I like when he does other things and the Irate Gamer creeps into it. Like Puppet Steve. And he'll start listing things off. Yes. He'll be like, wow! This toy's got them and just give you like a list of things and like, oh Chris. So your time of this, so you, your time of the sun is over. Chris Boar's telling the female Ghostbusters their time in the sun is over. He's going to stay with me in the fucking grave. No, come on down. You gotta eat. Would you rather play this game or meet Jacob? Oh wait, you already did both. Really glad I ate that sandwich. It's been the best thing that's happened to me this evening. Excellent. That's been a real highlight of the stream for me. Right, I'm going to turn my phone off so you can read the stream chat now. And I can pay more attention to this piece of amazing game. Alright, no, no, no. We can't Yeah, the, the soundtrack's fantastic. I like the part where the PlayStation goes. Ah! Best track. So that's uh, his song, A World on Fire. Let me take care of this. I have bigger lights. <laughs> I heard that. I will say whatever. Ready to install Life is Strange version something of another. I'm good. <laughs> so, yeah, you're alright, Chief. It's a, it's a patch, it adds gameplay. <laughs> it's like what Bethesda did with Fallout 76. Did you play the prequel? We did. We streamed it. We streamed the entire thing. And we waited and waited so fucking patiently for anything to happen. And it didn't. Nope. Things have happened. This has already been in the prequel because stuff's happened. They're, you know, lost in the woods and their dad got murdered and stuff. Nothing happened in Before the Storm. No. We did also, we also played Captain Spirit as well. Yeah, but we only played, that, that's a little, that's a little thing, isn't it? Captain yeah, that was Spirit just a little like, yeah. one-off thing. It was, to, to, it was to, up to the release of this game. Yeah. The ones I do. I bet. Now I'm the judge. And I say, <clears throat> no, show throw Chris for you. Uh, okay. Big easy trying to get revenge, judge. Hey, I want a new trial. Too late. Court closed. If we just, we're just playing a scene of, of kids camping. Yep. We could be camping. Yeah. And Weather's fairly nice. Yeah. Good fun, something to do. I got we, we got that old chair we need to get rid of. We could have gone outside and made a bonfire. Yesterday was yesterday. Yesterday was yesterday. Profound. <laughs> we have to do everything ourselves. <laughs> Tomorrow, it, today <laughs> is Friday. <laughs> Tomorrow, it's not Friday. <laughs> Mm. 
<laughs> you made a fire to me. Cat would be proud. Good I took those and not the beers. Daniel needed the sugar rush. Fish yeah. said that fun things are fun. I don't remember fun. Me neither. Uh, it's, it's a concept, it's sort of... It's very alien to me now. I don't remember what, what fun felt like. It's not quite full yet, Do you think there are werewolves for real? Yes. Dude, we are the wolves. Oh. See? What the oh, fuck God. does that mean? Oh, yesterday was yesterday. Dude, we are the wolves. Like, he hasn't started smoking the pot. Like, he didn't get a chance to go and buy it. No. And yet he's talking like, you know... And we are the wolves, you know what I'm saying? Like, Maybe they're wolves with the friends we made along the way. I'm saying like it's all connected, you know? It's like a, it's like, like the circle of life and shit. Oh, I'm now I'm one with the earth. Get out of my dorm room. I'm trying to sleep. Wonder if you shit, just talk about dreams. werewolves. Like, do you think werewolves are, are, are real? <coughs> Not in this fucking game, I don't. Because that would be interesting. No. You would just, just... Give us some werewolves. That would be. That would Have be... a scene where we're getting chased and we're gonna hide from werewolves. Way more interesting than cops. His dad was lucky. He got shot before seeing his kids okay, become buddy. furries. Yeah. <laughs> we've become far too tolerant towards furries as a culture, I think. Yes, we have. We've all just sort of started to accept it now. Like, yeah, well, you know, I don't understand it. And it creeps me out and it's disgusting. But, you know, they're not hurting anyone. We're far too tolerant. There's, there is such a thing as, as too much love. Yeah, too, much too much acceptance in the world. Too much freedom. Yeah. Way too much freedom. Some people have got too much freedom. <laughs> yep. Luckily, Don't worry, dude. Biden's going to put a stop to that. You were running yes. around all day. You tired out. Oh boy. It happens. Sleepy Joe. Sleepy Joe. Going to put all the furries in kennels. Like you put all those uh... Like you put all those kids. <laughs> <laughs> so I was thinking it. It's just like... <laughs> Thank you so much, Pimp Demon. Could this game be so part good. of the Illuminati? I mean, it does feel like it's it, it was made with some kind of insidious, you know, sinister agenda, so you could well be right. Pterodax. Although I think the, the Illuminati would be more competent at making a game. Yeah. Pterodax, thank you very much for the Canadian dollars. Very generous. Who came up with the gameplay of looking at things and having inner monologue about them? It's like they wanted a 3D point-and-click game but couldn't come up with any puzzles. It feels like that. It really does. Better than freezing out there, right? Way better. And a secure base. You did awesome to it, then. That's per that's a perfect description. Yeah. It's some absolute it's, it's yeah. spot on. Yeah, you're like a a real wilderness expert. Mm, that's cool. Oh, Jesus. Why do we have so many close ups of these characters? They're so proud of the detail, you know, the facial animations. Do you remember when we tried to stream uh, Mass Effect Andromeda? <laughs> and we got like an hour into it and we're like, this is not funny. Yeah. No one's having any fun. No one's laughing at this. Yeah. And we had Matt and Toby there too. Yeah, like the whole fucking team was here, and none of us could make it work. No. None of us could could make Mass Effect Andromeda funny. I, I'm sad that I lack the, the comedic chops to make Mass Effect Andromeda funny. I ended up just selling it. It's okay. I just had a bad dream. 
<laughs> kids like convulsing with sleep. Wouldn't it be great if like, little fangs came out, skin got all hairy? Instead of big, I mean, I can't imagine the werewolf transformations would look great with these graphics, but it'd, it'd be, be something. something. He just put his hand in the fire. Yeah. <coughs> okay. No, he just got uh, first degree burns. Is that going to be this kid's power? He's fireproof. Yeah. <laughs> That'll come in handy. <laughs> yes. Just a game where you can't be harmed. Very exciting. Invulnerability. Without any consequence. I almost put my foot in my bowl. Fucking load screen and the, the, the PlayStation is just like ah. Just while the game tries to load in the next poorly rendered environment. Trundling along. Look at it. What a fucking embarrassment. Oh, I remember what I've got to do now. There's that bit where I've got to beg for food off of this family. Exciting. Yeah. Look, it's easier now. <laughs> PlayStation. Yeah. Witness me! <laughs> yeah. That's, That's what you're hearing, that screeching sound is spraying. It's oh, like yes. spraying chrome on itself. For Valhalla. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna go to the PlayStation heaven in the sky. It's gonna get a machine heaven it's with all the robots and Shia LaBeouf for some reason. <laughs> you guys remember that shit, right? Nobody talks about the Transformers movies anymore. But do you remember seeing Transformers 2? And being like, this is crap through most of it. And then the movie just, just like smacks you in the face with how bad it is. Yeah. Like you find yourself, you sat there and you're going, well, maybe they're going to pull it together. And the movie just like leaps out and goes, because Shia LaBeouf dies and goes, not to human heaven, no, but to robot heaven. Surrounded by giant fucking robots. They're like, ah, you are not ready for death yet, Shia LaBeouf. Cannibal and he's like, no, 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 and then returns to Earth with the MacGuffin crystal. Oh, the Matrix yeah. of Leadership. Yeah, it doesn't fucking matter what it's called because there's a different one in the next movie. Like, what matters is this human protagonist, like two hours into the movie, goes to robot heaven. Inexplicably. Yeah. I think that's the most insulted I've ever been by a film. It was super insulting. Like, I'd never really had a film like, treat me like I was mentally retarded before. Plus a map. It's quite a feat. We can find the best route. Alright. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but you eat it. You're a long way from home, dude. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but it's weird. This will be my first Halloween away from home. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough. I want to go look at the bear. It might be better. The bear I statue, swear. look at it. Yeah. It's pretty great, isn't it? Yeah. Can we play as that instead? I guess this is local art. Yeah. It's nice. It sucks, I can't do Halloween Just get, um... Mumbo Jumbo to, like, enchant it so it comes to life. Game suddenly got a lot better. <laughs> Thank you, Teradax, once again. The game would be improved if the protagonists were giant robots. It was silly boring, but at least there would be giant robots. That's true. Giant robot car. More bears. Do they make actual money doing this? It's the kind of game where I want mundane Matt to guest appearance as an Uber driver that murders illegals in secret. <laughs> Oh yeah, that reminds me, guys. Make sure ad block is turned off for this. Uh... I love that pesky ad block. Not bad, Sean. 
I'm not even sure what kind of bird you are. But I'll keep this. I feel like getting trophies in this game is just adding insult to injury. Yeah, I picked up a feather. Terry Dex says, chicks dig giant robots. Hey, come on in. Let's wash them. God, oh my god, look at that time. Monday, 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 Monday. Fucking unbearable. Hey, how about mundane Matt toilet roll dispenser? You know, splash <laughs> the cow cars. Why is nothing of consequence happening? I know. It's a wash past. I don't know. Bum bum, I don't know. Okay. You're done. So who's coming to movie night nice. next time? I don't know when we're going to have the next one. Maybe Monday? I'm coming to movie night. Everybody in the chat going to come? Who was that? Who was at the last one? What did you think of your Hunter from the Future? Yeah, You'll know I loved it. So I know Bean Daddy was there. I know Jeremy Dodgers was there. Um... Prada with a no was there. Oh, more people. Hey. Thank you, Pimp Demon. No, it'd be good if they died at the beginning and, you know, it was the Why? end roll and end Why credits or whatever the fuck it was called. Sean, I don't want to do this. I agree. The game needs to just stop. Are you cuter? Even Lila thinks so. You're awesome people. Uh oh, are there whites over there, Gemma? Yes, there's whites. Oh, we need to, uh, you know, there are, there are whites. Bum, 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 which is great because the target audience of these movies are sort of people who like the new Star Wars movies. So yes. No one's ever really gone. Thank you, Terry Dex. Living here in Jersey, fighting villains from afar, you've got to grind first gear in your giant robot car. I only know that. I don't, I've never actually seen the show that that comes from. I just know it from the YouTube poop. The, <laughs> rob, uh, the Dr. Robotnik one. I think it's Robotnik Blinks. or It's one of those. It's a bo Boogity Boo one. Boogity Boo. Yeah. It's like, leave my giant robot car alone. Yeah. I miss YouTube print. Now, all right, I need I need something. I need a beverage of some kind. YouTube poop. Now there was content. <laughs> this isn't a game, Gemma. Quake Three. That was a game. Yes, it was. See, I'm the same. I'm allergic to Monster Energy drinks. Just like that was. <sighs> I'm gonna go run out in the middle of the road and see. Oh damn it! I can't even. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't even step out to the road. I can't go into the the road. game. They they deliberately coded it like that because they knew your instinct would be to run the protagonist into oncoming traffic. Last night was so cold. I don't even want to think about it. I've got far too many notifications. What's happening? I always had a thing for gas stations. We stopped at so many on road trips. I'm fine. I'm too young. Sean? You see that sign? Um... I, yeah. After the night we just had? I like that, in a way, like, ah, uh, here's a chainsaw, call Sam R. Ugh, I hate that. Sean? Uh, yeah, I'm surprised there's a Sam Raimi reference in here, you know, considering how racist he is. Yes. 
How was he allowed to do it, though? You yeah. sound like uh, an expert, dude. Uh, he keeps getting away with it. Hey, look. They're gonna teach us Spanish. Este tipo es un idiota. <laughs> the Evil Dead. No Remember fun? I, I feel like Frodo is like, I can't recall the taste of food. Like, <laughs> Did that mic unplug just as I made that excellent joke? Mm. Really annoyed. Never heard that was a great joke time. as well. Oh, it's a fair superhero. Power man in the backwoods. More like power marketing. Hey man, check this out. Power bear draw? Uh, can we play? I bet it's you easy to get a prize. Yeah, no. See all those prizes still inside? Nobody wins except for each other. But hey, we're the Wolf Brothers. Let's teach this machine a lesson, right? Yes. So, who goes first? <sighs> kind of drained at this point. Me too. Okay, like, really tired. Yeah, I'm just like this is just sad. Mm -hmm. We better grab that prize. Let me get him to sell. Here we go. Well, Thank you, Oscar Rock. Very nice of you. Oh boy, time for the epic saga of the Mexican furry and his psychic little brother. I mean, epic saga or just, you know, country stroll, however you want to put it, really. Come on. Let's not waste time on that stupid thing. No, Daniel. But look, we're already surrounded by this. I want to be surrounded by this. Well, you can be. Just go to bed. I'll just bust out my platinum card. <laughs> Dad would have loved this so much. Yeah, well, you know. He's dead. I don't know much about your dad. I know what he did love was running towards armed police officers. Yes, he did. <laughs> My damn <arm> pepper road <laughs> cred. Sorry, dude. Welcome to Tommy's Holiday Camp. Come back here after all this. Wait, there's a fucking reference to Tommy in this? No tourist is gonna do this shit. And I'm pretty sure the last time I played this, I probably made that same ref like same observation. I hope Halloween is a room for Dan by all this. Bears, what bears weeps nervously? It's better than Tadpog. So, Orange Wizard, are you saying it was suicide by cop? So, oh god, my shit kids are in trouble again. Fuck it! I can't make a fancy sandwich. Had enough! My wife left me. My kids are garbage. Dude, I wish I could send my a postcard, like a regular hand. And one of the world's largest fish on the top of a small boat. Wish I could send my a postcard, like a regular. Um, no, I'm cool. Thanks. Daniel will start this down. Look at that blank emotion on his face. Riley would love that. It's just in this game set at Halloween and the kid like res resembles Michael Myers and his level of expressiveness. Yeah, it's like complete nothingness. Can't believe lost one. Imagine, right, this is what my you know, because you, you never get to hear Michael Myers speak or anything. This is actually what he's like. Hey there. This is what he's thinking about when he's just going around murdering people. Hey, hi. sorry about my brother. I remember I remember this guy. Yes, yeah, so the only good white person in this story looks like definitely the person who coded it. I know. I don't mean I mean it's 
it's not as weird as it seems, though. These people, they only want to live a normal life. Just naked. I mean, if they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? Nobody. Yeah, I agree. Yes, why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> yeah, you might go as far as to say, diversity is our strength. Fuck off. Fuck off, Journo. Fuck off and die. Just a fancy name for someone who drives around This game gives you plenty of people to hate. Cops and journalists. Yes. Thank you, Terry Dax. I'd rather learn about what life choices led to Frankenstein's monster becoming a beer pitchman than continue with this non plot. It, you're absolutely right. Non plot is the perfect way to describe it. There's nothing to this. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. The earlier, the better. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, but I'm already up. Teradex, did he have porn on that laptop in public without caring when two children just walked up to him and get in his car later? Hey, nonsense can do whatever they like. Biden's president now. <laughs> <laughs> Too soon? <laughs> Shaking his whole body while he talks. That's the diabetes. Yeah. He talks a lot. Whatever. I do not talk too much. You always say that. That's not true. Yes. Can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. You don't look like you're from here. You're one of those Italians. Thank you, Pimp Demon. I'd rather spend a day with Jacob. He sounds nice. It's like, I assume he means a different oh, Jacob. Jacob. Yeah? Not the Jacob that just screamed, fuck off, Jerno. I can't remember the name. It's not far. I see. Well, I don't think I'm going to But world do these writers live in? France. Yes, they're, they're French apparently. Oh, it's no big deal. Um, just a short field trip. We're not that far from home. Hmm. We don't look like everybody else who stops by. Was your hulking older man would walk in, spit at the kid's feet, and say, "I've killed lots of your kind in now." Uh, madam, I think you need to touch the register. She's actually senile. She doesn't work there. She's like the the mother of the person who owns the shop. So, sorry, sorry, guys. Come on, mum. Let's get you back to bed. I ain't trying to do a transaction. <laughs> no, Mr. President. Let's get you back to get you back to bed now. Let old Harris take uh, care of it, all right? You go back to bed. I got, I got, I got hairy legs! <laughs> what a world! Who's the guy with Who's the guy with him? Is that supposed to be someone famous? <laughs> yep. It's a famous Hollywood director or something. He made a show up here, but we don't watch TV. David Lynch, for some reason, in here. What's that? Wow. <laughs> something interesting happening here. Perfect. We should be able to find our way with this. Hey, well, what's your name, you pony salesman? Go on. Come on. You bothered the customers enough. Thanks. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking hey, places. Check out the See the baby bear there? It's a real nice map. I'm going to smack your face. What? <laughs> Got the hairs on my legs, and the, and the the children they grip, they pull my leg hairs out, and the blonde hairs. And it's it's so good. I love that video. It's just like, I got I got hairy legs. That's 
that that turn. Perfect. And he got, kind of holds on turn for a while that you think he, he like means physically like spin he's like uh blah the turn blonde in in the sun. <laughs> it's like yeah. What the fuck are you talking about? That's uh, I, I learned about roaches and I learned about kids jumping on my lap. Like, uh, Mr. President, do you know about Joe? Joe? <laughs> do not do it. Joe <laughs> God damn it, Gemma. Gemma, you pony salesman. <laughs> By the way, I mean you, Jacob. You sound like a nice guy. Oh dear. I'm not. You know, R slash nice guy. Yeah, I am a nice guy. I always got called Gemma a whore all the time and just reply my text. It's constant, so I just uh, let it let it wash over me like water on a duck. You can't take care of a dog like Take the dog and hide it prison style. Gonna go outside, gonna meet the husband who doesn't like Hispanics. Let's be real, Gemma. No one likes Hispanics. <laughs> no, it's the Latinx one. Just waiting to get. I'm just waiting to get my channel taken off me at this point. Let's grab it. Check out this movie. Narrating myself. Shit, they're still looking for us. We can't go back. Seattle shooting ignites protest. That's the most realistic part of the game so far. Yes. A cop shot someone and like people are rioting about it. Yes. What did I miss? Nothing. <laughs> you missed positively fuck all. You can't you can't walk into a Life is Strange stream and be like, you know what I miss? Because invariably the answer will be fuck all. Like, don't feed the best. Just hard cuts to the, like <laughs> fucking the, the older kid. You know, like the kind of like shock, uh, shock face is like trying to hide. She's got a beehive in one arm. It's like hardly pouring out. She's just slowly dipping yeah. a salmon in it. It's like, like don't feed the bears. You did not miss the build the wall line there. You've still got that to go. No, this can't be here. Um, definitely not there. All right, this is it. Are you sure? Yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so, can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Oh, but it looks cool. Hold on. I'll find where we can go. Hey, Pizza, so oh, oh, here we are. Yeah. 
just going over trails and stuff. It's dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watching. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you pay for all that. You know, it's all the way job to do so. Uh, sir, we paid for this. And that was for you. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you got. Uh, no, thanks. Yeah, we're shoplifters and we're sitting no. immediately outside the shop we're we stole from inside. with all our products. Yep. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it, it's okay. Look, our, our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me. Don't do it, boy. Let go. Don't touch my brother. <laughs> Oh, come on, say it. Just fucking say it, dude. We're all waiting. The whole stream's been leading up to this. Yep. Apparently you're in 1996. Yeah. Oh, well, shit. Windows 95. Yeah, like, well, no, no, no. Thank you. Don't do this to me. Just looks around and it's just like, he's all delirious like that and he's just on the back of a wagon. Oh, you're finally awake. Yeah. <laughs> Could you imagine? If the whole game was this one was just one big troll for you to get hit in the head and it just... You're, ju Skyrim. you're just playing Skyrim. Yeah. <laughs> and that's why it's making that noise. Cause she said you're finally awake. <laughs> um, you punched me in the stomach. You weird racist. I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try, but I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. So. Maybe I should call Ice to make sure you're a citizen. <laughs> Subtle. Watch it, punk. Whatever. You want to deal with this? Yes. Pretty sure yes. what the police are about for me or what? Fuck like you. Oh, see how he, like, he censored a oh, racial slur like with the word thug? Because when people say, when people see someone burning down a... Uh, you know, a city on television called them a thug. They really mean the N-word. Yep. If you give me any second thoughts about living out in the middle of nowhere, that's what's safe for me, kid. He's lucky you won't end up with this criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason you need to build that wall. <laughs> there he is! You're the reason we need to build that wall. It's. I it mean. Makes me cringe. Guys, we are living in one fucking society, aren't we? Yes. This is Trump's America, folks. <laughs> America, more like America KKK. -er. Build it. I can't believe he actually says you're finally awake. Like he's gone for now. That was amazing. I'm always be scared shitless. I can't leave him out there.
We get it. We're the perfect Americans. I'm sorry. <laughs> the recording of Toby singing the Jurassic Park theme song every time you know a line like that comes up, it's like <laughs> there is me to build that wall. Da 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 da. What made the orange man fat? Uh, it's quarter to, uh, quarter to twelve. I see. We have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah. We've got to hurry, though. We call the cops on us. Think, dude. There's got to be a way out of here. Can you try and open this vent? Don't worry. We'll figure something out. Hey, you think you can open the back door? I think I've um I've run out of commentary. Me too. Just the f just racist Father Christmas just did it. There we are, Terry Dax, thank you very much. Why are there so many references to bears? Don't feed them, power bear, stuffed bears, fat bearded man, and yet still there are no actual bears. I do not know. There need to be more actual bears. Yes, there needs to be bears. It is. Be careful. It might attract him. Um, somebody asked this question earlier, and I'm going to answer it because it's been asked again. What's worse, writing this or Sonic EXE the remake? Uh, this. Sonic EXE the remake has conflict and narrative contrivances that take the plot in, you know, directions where there's violence and excitement and tension. They're both very dull. I mean, there's a whole section in there about watching Netflix and eating pizza. But there's way more of that kind of stuff in this game. Like in the entire like, first 40 minutes was just you dossing around the house talking to yourself. Yeah. Fuck. Vince texted me saying, Don't say anything that will get yourself banned. Because when I said that line about no one liking Mexicans. <laughs> I understand why JC would be watching Netflix roasted. That's because he likes Avatar Last Day, Bender. He likes Legend of Korra. No, it's because he, because obviously Cutie's just the, just the joke. Thank you again, Terry Dex. The, oh, okay, then, the reference to Sonic.exe makes me wonder if that stuffed bear that fell off the shelf is one of X's spy plushies. I think, you know, there's a, there's a line in the original Sonic EXE where it, the story says he tortures those who play his games in more ways than one. And I wonder if this is one of his games. This interdimensional monster, interdimensional god monster. Who has video that, that drives you insane and tortures you? This has got to be part of the plan. Life is strange too. I imagine that's probably making a lot of noise on the microphone. Sorry. I'm getting kind of like antsy because um, I'm kind of like my body, like my body's starting to get tired. This is it. You brutal, Daniel. We should go to bed then. I'm gonna yeah, get tired. Let's do this. I go to bed. Yeah. This game has a ten out of ten on Steam. Yes. 
It's barely a game. I had to do button mashing there. Paper team and OMG, this, the teddy bear is one of his seven guardians. <laughs> the old man is Ooga Booga, the warrior of racism. <laughs> What was on his computer screen there? I have no clue. It wasn't his little screen anymore. It was else. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Yeah. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. Tyrodex, so when you get sucked into the game and turn into one of the characters, will Derek Green investigate why your body has lost its soul? That was genuinely one of the more frustrating parts of any story we've read. The whole stole se soul stealing thing. Yeah. You fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to chill for the rest of your life. What's wrong with you? Waiting till I get to a bit where I have to play again and then I'll turn it off because I don't want to have to do all that again when we do the next one. Get in the uh, porno watching journalist's car. I, I, I don't trust journalists, but I'll stay out here in the rain with racists after me. Yeah, I'd be the same. Here comes the white man to save the Mexicans. Yeah. Because the target audience of this game fucking look like that. Fat white guys with glasses and big beards. Soys. He looks like someone who would defend cuties. Looks like someone who got watch, a you're watching, yeah, you're, watch, you're watching cuties and you're thinking, look at the blonde. This is crazy. Damn, that is crazy. Oh, dude, this has been a long car journey. Can you shut the fuck up about your girlfriend's OnlyFans account. <laughs> he was a total fucking dickhead. Man, it felt good to eat his ass. Could he be the <laughs> long foretold <laughs> saviour <coughs> of the Mexican people? Sorry, the legendary man. chosen one. I'm just still pissed off. <laughs> Welcome to the <laughs> One but not forgotten. 
Don't tell me yeah, how to play. More big out here than Mexicans. No doubt. People out here are more scared of you and your little brother. This is nuts. People scared of, of Mexicans in the countryside no, of Washington? I do. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <laughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. Daniel. What? The secret. <laughs> We're heroes. Yeah, yes, we are. <laughs> so. That's a really horrible looking creature. I'm dying. Also, like the close up down the throat reminded me of all the kind of creepy war oh, art cool. you see on DeviantArt. Let's see. Um, mm -hmm. How about mushroom? I'm not saying that that was someone's fetish when they animated it, I'm just not, not saying. What the fuck do you call your dog mushroom? Yeah, that's pretty We've passed 1858 <laughs> messages in the chat, which reminded me of the 1858 Bradford Sweets poisoning. 200 people were poisoned in that, and yet this game has hurt more people than that ever could. Thank you very much. Thank you for that. Nice. I feel like I just witnessed history. I can't believe we're stuck in a car with a fucking Reddit user. Well, thanks for helping me rescue this wholesome puffer. Wholesome puffer? Did we say puffer, by the way? Just need to be fucking scout. Puffer. Look at my doggo. He's such a good boy. I'm like, get in. Get in the oven. Come on. Hurry yourself now. Only certain people can say it. No one. No people. No one's allowed. So, what do we do exactly? Long boring story short. I come from a family with money. But I am a rich man. I took off after school. And never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites. For zines! Podcasts, you write protests. stories for zines. Try to make some positive change. Try to make some positive change. Wow. So you're like all... Political. Everything is political, Sean. Dude, shut the fuck up! Man, that sounds cool. Don't you ever get kind of lonely? Well, I got my cuties DVD there to keep me going, so. <laughs> Man, you probably need a lot of people out here. That's right. The unseen side. America. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, the unseen oh, side of America. I.e., the, the stuff that's the day, we have to watch out in the news constantly. Yeah. Yeah, totally. Watch out for us. No one knows Thank about you. racism or anything like that. Seriously. No. Or anything political. The social justice doesn't exist. <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh. Does anyone know if Cubes is still on Netflix? I'd like to know because I'm basically I, I'm not getting Netflix again until they until they take that away. And like Logan's a bit annoyed that we don't have Netflix anymore. And my son, I kind of have to have the strength of my conviction. Yeah. Traveling by night is better. Plus, to be honest, Amazon Prime's been pretty decent recently. Like, yeah. um. They've just put Parasite on Prime, so that'd be something that we can watch. Because obviously, like, you know, we've watched, like, a ton- we've watched your Hunter from the Future three times, but we haven't seen 2020's Best Picture. Tim Demon. I, uh... I guess talking about clockwork is political. Why not, eh? I bet someone's gonna write like 
right some sort of creepy pasta about clockwork going. Your time is up, Trump. Get could out you, of the office. Could you imagine? It was like some someone in the year twenty twenty writing another running a clockwork story. I can imagine it. Uh, I prefer not to. I'm just going to play it to the end because there's not much left. There's maybe another 10, 15 minutes left. I'd, I just, I, like, I'd rather, like, when we do the next stream, we'll start part two. Yeah. Ah, I see. 1954, like, that was the year Godzilla came out. Back in a couple of months when you're ready to stream part one again. <laughs> Thank you, Terry. There. Um, it was the police. It's their fault. Damn, we just wanted to play zombie outside. A shift at neighbor was picking on me. I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then, One of my dad. Your dad died how he lived. Idiotically. Running and flailing his arms at nervous trigger happy police officers. <laughs> Stop it! Right. Stop Yeah. It's Calm down, good. officer. Like, no, dude, it's not the time. You don't tell people to calm down. Well, you know. You I don't mean talking to anybody. Police officer pointing a gun at you saying, get on the floor. I'm like, all right, I've done nothing wrong, but that's not the issue right now. I'll complain when I've been taken into the station. Yes. And can complain Listen, to my lawyer that I've been unfairly really treated. Sorry. Because I'll, I'll be, be alive. alive. Yeah. Injustice is everywhere. For example, I'm allowed this beard. <laughs> but you're gonna be okay, Sean. Sure. His name's fucking Brody. With a Y. How? I wish I could go back to my town. Even if it was boring like that one. At least I've had friends. Family. A home. I used to bitch about it so much. I Injustice is everywhere, including in my basement. Nothing. You should see what I've got down there, kid. It's fucking terrifying. What his shirt is. I and mean, I'm a bad man. Nice. But you can't look back now. Even God won't forgive me for what I've done. We got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? We may not see what you and your brother have. You ever eat those human meat, kid? He needs me. You ever. You mm -hmm. down the school. I can tell he doesn't know Ever what happened. See a grown man Sean, make That's something. Do a crap into another man's record and just watch tell. him cry. I am proud of that reference. Like, but remember in Scotland. Yeah, well, it's gameplay. Oh there is oh I I press a button? Yeah. Alright, there we go. Um I just have to play whew, it time. That was um, but remember, in Scotland they don't get a lawyer until the cops are done questioning them. I'm very proud of that reference. You don't tell people who've been through trauma to calm down. You get on their level and try to relax them. Crying is healing, yelling at your frustration is healing, etc. 
Where are you going? What about Fuck just <laughs> crying? It sounds pretty <laughs> fucking unmanly to me. So. Except when Reb does it. It's okay when Reb cries, because he's Reb. I thought I was the one owl traveler. It's when Reb cries, it's manly. We have 2016 comments. (laughs) Uh, Maybe this is crazy, but should we just keep going until we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes. This is exactly what you're supposed Cope, to do. Cope, Gemma, gameplay. Gemma, oh, I press a button. Cope, cool. yes. Sums up modern games perfectly. Press a single button every few minutes and watch it go. Did I just hear Neo Nazi? Probably. Sure fucking garbage is left. Like 15, 20 minutes. I don't know if it's up to the long way to go. We've shot the ship long enough. Time to hit the road. Do you know what? I think I had more fun playing it the last time, and I think I know why. I'll drop you by a hotel in a couple of hours. I think because I, um, I wasn't sober. Most unrealistic part of this game is it's about two people go, you know, trying to get into Mexico. <laughs> I don't understand in America, there's too much food and medicine. Not nearly enough drug cartels. No. I was just trying to think Puerto Lobo is the wolf port. Wolves port. Apparently, wolves and bears are tremendously important to the story. What was it that was really important to Life is Strange? Ju- well, just butterfly. Fuck. It was whales. Whales and butterflies. It's fucking just whales that washed up on the shore. Uh, no. Oh, remember that whole bit where, like, you hung out with Chloe, but you, but she was, like, a cripple? Yeah, and then... You had to kill her? Then you just returned to your normal timeline and none of that happened. Yeah. The consequence, it wasn't even there. Too bad sandcastles never last. That's why they're called sandcastles. Pim Demon, never let Logan play this game at all. Yeah, I wouldn't let Logan play this. I, you know, I, I don't believe in in, <sighs> in making your kids suffer like that. And the thing is, he's not the kind of kid who uh, who's in into things ironically. He's a very sincere person. I don't think he'd enjoy something to make fun of it. We're so lucky, bro. No. He helped us. If it wasn't for him, we... Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Hey, let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yeah. I've noticed it's starting to calm down. Well, the, uh, okay. Yeah, it's done it a couple of times. Okay, puppy. Throughout the game. Go wide. It's the first time I'm actually noticing it for longer than like a, like a few seconds. Come on, mushroom. Get it. Go, mushroom. Right, guys. Uh, I'm going to bed because uh, life's too short. So yeah, let's go to bed. Um. Bye. Bye.